Hi, this is Asin. You are now watching Asin SL TV. Today, I would like to show you how to copy worksheet to a new workbook and save without formatting and formulas. Let's go to Developer tab, click on Visual Basic, insert a module, and start by giving a name. So we have sub the name. Let's say copy sheet. We are going to use for loop to instruct Excel to run through all these sheets and create a new copy. So I'm going to first define theme WS. Simply use any letters or any words to represent the object that we want. So we have WS as worksheet. Next is to run through using for loop for each WS the worksheet in this active. We have workbook here, active workbook dot worksheets. We want to run through all the worksheets in this workbook. So firstly is to create a copy. So we have worksheet dot copy. Next is to clear the formats. So we should have active workbook dot sheets number one. We should always bear in mind that if let's say we create a new sheet by default, in the new workbook, the numbering always starts with 1. So we can use 1 all the while for all these worksheets. Since this is in the new workbook, definitely will be starting from 1. And what we need here is to clear all the cells formatting. So we have cells.clear formats. Since we have clear the formats, next is to clear the formula. To clear the formula, we should copy again first. So we have dot copy. Next is to paste without formula. Dot paste special. And what kind of instruction we want to instruct Excel to perform? In other words, the paste type we want the Excel to perform. We should first type paste colon followed by equal sign. And next, we can go to Google and we type paste special VBA and we look for the Microsoft documentation. Next is to scroll down and click on the Excel paste type and we should look for the correct instruction. Copy the name and back to VB, paste it here. Next, we can now save this workbook since it's already free of formatting, free of formulas. We can now save. So we have active workbook dot save and we need to save as since this is a new workbook which is not currently saved and we should paste the location here if let's say we don't have any idea where should we paste we can move to the current file location right click the file and click on properties look for the location or simply click on the location bar copy and paste it here since the location must be in terms of string, make sure we use quotation mark. So start with quotation. Before we close quotation, remember to use backslash since we want to connect with the name of the file. So we use emphasis to join the name and the name that we are going to use is the active sheet itself. So we have active sheet dot name. And we use emphasis to join the file type or the file format. Also use quotation mark and we type dot xlsm if we want to save this as macro enable workbook. However, if you want to free of macro, then we should use x instead. So have quotation mark close. Next is to press enter and we should consider to close this workbook. So to close this workbook, simply type active workbook.close since we don't want to keep all the files in open mode. We should close every time we have saved. Next, we have next. Since we have done for the first worksheet and we should proceed to the next worksheet. Let's see the result. So when we Click on run, we should have file created and save close, save close. So let's check whether is the one that we are looking for. So we click on one of the files that we created. As we can see, originally we have formatted in this format with merge cells and the words are red in color. Now check, we have no formats here. And how about the next? shape currently we have colors and we have formulas 
So we look for the Excel sheet, which is now the Excel workbook. So once we open, we can check that no more colors, no more formula. And finally, the last sheet that we have. So we have the last sheet, which is TV. And we check that this is without any formatting or formula. As we can see, this is with formulas. And this is with formatting, as we can see here. But this is not. Okay, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you like this. See you.